My name is Doug Sockman. I'm with Skylight Financial Group. Uh, proud to be here this afternoon. Uh, we're actually one of the sponsors, along with Smart Business. Okay. So you'll you'll see a few of us wandering around. Okay. Um, looking forward to hearing Tom and his message, and uh, thank everybody for coming. I'm here just to really hear about what Tom Zenti has to say about healthcare in the city. Wonderful. Hi, Molly Nider. I work at Tri-C as well. I'm Director of Healthcare Careers Initiative, and uh, UH is one of our partners, and we're interested in hearing what Mr. Zenti sees for the future. My name is Michael Foyer, and I'm CEO and founder of Max Wellness, a new retail concept for health and wellness. Yes. And also a columnist for eight years with Smart Business. Okay. And author of a new book, The Benevolent Dictator. My uh, name is Dan Brennan with Skylight Financial Group. We're the uh, sponsor of the event. We're interested in the uh, economic development of the area. Uh, clearly, UH is making a significant contribution, well over a billion dollars in development. Uh, so it's uh, something we're interested in hearing what their next plans are and see how it fits into the overall scheme for the, for the region. As Cleveland and the county goes, our business goes. So it's really critical that we all work together for the greater good of all. Oh, that's wonderful. Welcome to everyone. This is a record crowd for one of our smart business functions, so we are very, very excited about that. One thing that you don't ever see, but that is critically important, is we've now spent about $140 million on the creation of integrated electronic health record. And it sounds rather simple to have one patient in one record, but it costs us about $140 million to date to get there. But it's critically important because although we can talk about buildings and programs and services, what really needs all of this together is information technology and our ability to have one patient, one record. If, if our goal is to keep the youth in Ohio, you know, I, I think we can do a much better job, quite frankly, focusing on what various industries' needs are going to be, both today, 3, 5, 10, even 15 years from now. And let's begin to true up the educational programs that we're offering in both the community college level, at the undergraduate level, at the graduate level, and I know in healthcare alone, there are a tremendous number of opportunities where we know we're going to need particular types of people who are not available today. So I've actually talked to the governor about this as a, as a topic of interest for us, but not just about healthcare. We should be doing this in every industry in our country's time. It should be in manufacturing, it could be in business, it could be in advertising. Hi there, I'm Jim Talton. I'm with uh, Synergy uh, uh, Marketing and Research and Strategy Company. Uh, and uh, we're just delighted to be here to support the program. I boil it down to the individual, and I think as individuals we need to live healthier lifestyles, eat healthier, exercise regularly, and take it upon ourselves to help resolve some of the health care issues that plague our community. Thank you, Thank you very much. That's right. very good advice Pleasure for all of us. Pleasure to be here. Us.